is Arzy. 2-1. Uh, we're just going to have a look at the goals because I've watched some of the highlights already. Um, let's go to the first goal. It's roughly around this area. What a ball. I think it's Steve. What a goal. What a goal. Uh, I think my goal for the season is to make an away day and go give the team some support on an away day. It's tough because Leverstock uh, were part, uh, third in the league, so it's tough. Um, let's go to when they scored the second goal. I think it's about here. Yeah, they ping it in the box. Yep, tapping. What a goal! But not what a goal, but like it was going to be difficult against third place in the league. So now I'm going to read you. I'm going to read you an article in a minute. Um, yeah, so it was really an unlucky, at the end of the day, we look at it, it was an unlucky result, Leverstock are higher in the league, it's going to be tough, so yeah, it's time to just read the article that was posted on the Facebook group chat, if we have a look at this, see, I've got my phone, Um, if you want to join in the group chat, it's on Facebook, it's called the RZ, oh, you can see it says the RZ Town, Town FC supporters. So, yeah, I'm going to read you the article that I got from there. Um, about the youth football and, yeah, it's an article on that. RZ Youth Football Club has undergone a remarkable revival, making a significant achievement in the local sports scene. From a modest count of, team, of just three youth team several seasons ago the club now proud the boasts a total of 10 teams catering to both boys and girls from under eights to under 18s this expansion reflects not only the club's dedication but also the growing interest and participation in the youth football within the community in addition of girls teams underscorers the club commitment to exclusivity and providing opportunities for all aspiring footballers regardless of gender this progressive step not only enhances the diversity of the club but also encourages more girls to engage in sports and fostering a culture of equality and empowerment the surge in youth teams is m merely a numerical feat but also signifies the positive impact of grassroots in a Innovatives. I don't know that word. I'm really sorry. Um, in nurturing young, young talent initiatives. Oh yeah, there you go. In young talent, in young talent, beyond the realm of sports, a thriving youth football club holds immense benefits for community of Alsi. It fosters a sense of camaraderie and belonging of belonging among residents, promoting social cohesion and community spirit. For the children involved in part involved. Participation in youth football offers a myriad of adventures extending beyond the pitch. Regular physical activity contributes to their health and fitness, instilling lifelong habits of exercise and well-being. Moreover, engaging in team sports cultivates important life skills such as teamwork, communication and resilience, which are invaluable for personal development. <sighs> Furthermore... Football provides a constructive outlet for children to channel their energy and emotions, promoting mental well-being and stress relief. The sense of achievement de derived from setting and achieving goals on the field boosts confidence and self-esteem, nurturing a positive mindset that transcends into other aspects of their lives. As RC youth football continues to grow and flourish, there is a call for enthusiastic volunteers to support its expansions, whether as coaches or players, or sorry, or parent helpers, these individuals play a pivotal role in shaping the experience of young players and contributing to the fabric of the local community. If you 
if you feel you you or your child would like to get involved then please contact the head of youth development so yeah that's the article what i really think of that is i'm glad that's happening because for once we've got obviously we've got youth coming through multiple teams now people getting opportunities more opportunities than ever community coming together um i might try it and be a volunteer we'll see let's see what i feel like but i think i'll try to be maybe but we'll see we'll have to wait and see and if i am i'll announce it on this channel probably so yeah next game for rz is against stansted so cooney i reckon is gonna bounce back at home um yeah so thank you guys for watching this pretty short video kind of long but there's my review thank you guys for watching um i will see you mate see you later come on you blues oh sorry let me let me add one one more thing um good luck next game obviously i probably won't be there but yeah good good luck